Hi hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will let you know how to modify your taskbar. This is taskbar and your window, and I will let you know how to modify this. So for that, you first need to open the settings of taskbar, and you can do that by pressing the window buttons followed by X button on your keyboard to open this menu. So you can come to taskbar manager and uh, the other way is to search in the taskbar search and write taskbar settings and clicking on taskbar settings will open the taskbar and the other way is to uh, right click on the taskbar and click on the taskbar settings whichever way you want to open this you can do that and when you open the taskbar settings it looks like this so i'm already here on the taskbar uh, option in the left panel menu and you see here we have different uh, power toggle buttons some placed on the on position and the other on the off positions and, and if you are opening the taskbar settings for the first time the setting of your computer may be different however you can change the settings as you wish so this is like the taskbar button. I keep this off because this allows me to change the size of the taskbar. If I bring the cursor down to the taskbar and put it one edge, it becomes a double arrow. Then I press the left button on my mouse and drag it up. I can, this is one size increase and this is second step increase in the size of the taskbar. Similarly, I can reduce the size if I put the cursor and become and let it become a double arrow, then dragging it down would reduce the size of the taskbar. However, if I turn this button to the on position and then I bring the cursor down to the taskbar, it doesn't become double arrow. It means it is not allowing me to resize or increase or decrease the size of the taskbar. So the taskbar is now locked. So I keep this always off. Then there is automatically hide taskbar in desktop mode. So if I turn this on, the uh, taskbar automatically hides. And if I bring the cursor down to the taskbar position, it reappears. So if you are interested to automatically hide your taskbar, just ta turn on this power toggle button. And I keep this off for my purposes. Then there is the uh, automatically hide the taskbar in tablet mode. If you are using the tablet mode and you don't want your taskbar to be on the top all the time, you can turn this one on and again the taskbar will automatically be uh, hidden when you are working. So I don't use the tablet mode, I use the desktop mode, therefore I switch this off. Then uh, I have switched this one on and probably in your computer this may be off, but uh, it changes the size of icons on the taskbar. For example, if I turn this off, you see the size of the icons of the apps is now larger. And if I turn this on, it go back to small sizes. Then there is another option use Peak to review the desktop means uh, when I keep this power toggle on and I bring the cursor to the, the, the desktop button that is to this corner, it show me the desktop uh, disappearing all the apps that are on. And if I remove this, all the apps are back on the screen. So thus keeping the, the power but the power toggle on would give you this appearance. Therefore, I keep this on and if, I've, and if I turn this off and I then bring the cursor to the same button, it does nothing. So I keep this on because that is needed to me. So then there is this one option, replace command prompt with Windows PowerShell in the menu when I right click the start button or press Windows key plus X. So you can turn on and off this if you are interested to switch on PowerShell. 
Okay, now uh, I don't want to discuss this one, but the, the, the important thing that I must tell you is this one, taskbar location on screen. You can change the location of your taskbar, though by default it is always at the bottom, but there are three other options as well. I can take the taskbar to left, if I click, the taskbar is then taken to the left of the screen. And similarly, I can take this to top. If I select the top, then it is taken to the top. And similarly, you can take this to the right, but I keep this at the bottom. And the next one option that you can change is this one. Uh, I have placed this on never, and by default, it is always on the first uh, option that is always hide labels. If I click this one, what happens? The labels or the buttons of the program that are switched on is now compact and or hidden. If I keep the cursor on the PDF uh, icon, it shows that there are two files in this menu. Similarly, on the folder, folder show me that there is one program on and uh, However, if you are not interested in that, there is another one when taskbar is full. If you select this one option, the, uh, well, the, the taskbar button would be combined only when the taskbar is full, but I keep this on never. Then there is, this is an additional option, but I come to this one, select which icon appears on the taskbar. If I click this one, there is a long list of different apps which you can uh, switch on or off to, to be present on the taskbar or not. I have switched on for a few of them. These are visible all the time. For example, if I switch off this one, the uh, dictionary world web would disappear from the taskbar. You see it, is, it disappears. Similarly, uh, if I uh, switch off a network so the network sign at this position would also disappear and i keep this on because i want to i want them to be present on my taskbar let's go back and then there is another option that uh, that turns system icons on or off if i click on this i get again a list of different apps that you can uh, talk that you can switch on or switch off for the taskbar. So this is again your wish. For example, if I switch on here is the clock, and if I switch this off, the clock disappears. Similarly, if I switch volume, the volume icon disappears. So I keep them on the taskbar. So I turn them on back. There are certain other uh, options on the taskbar that you can play with. Okay, this is the option for multiple displays. If you are using multiple displays, you can switch this on to whether show the taskbar on the other displays or not. So this way you can modify your taskbar. Thanks for watching.